Can you imagine what it would sound like if atheists started talking like Christians? I'm not an atheist. I'm just a follower of reason. Oh, hi, new neighbor. What library do you go to? I love believers. I just hate their beliefs. I have a personal relationship with reality. You're religious? Oh, well, I'll think for you. You don't act like a Christian. You're really open-minded. Oh, God loves me? Well, Darwin explains you. Axial tilt is the reason for the season. I do good in the world because it's the atheist thing to do. You know what they say, the universe works in non-mysterious ways. Oh, stop complaining about my beliefs. You just hate reason. But it's okay. Reason loves you anyway. I just found a great parking spot. Thank you, random chance. We all have a truth-shaped hole in our brain. Conservatives are waging a war on science. You know what? That one actually makes sense. I know it's frustrating that your glass shattered on the floor, but remember, gravity has a plan for you. I would like to thank my great genes for my team's victory tonight. A lot of people reject atheism because they just don't want to obey the laws of physics. With science, all things are somewhat probable. You don't accept evolution? Then what's stopping you from murdering people if you don't think altruism guides your biological fitness? Just because you don't believe in evolution doesn't mean you didn't evolve. Deep down, I know you really believe in the scientific method. You don't accept science? That's just because you haven't gone to the right natural history museum yet. If you don't accept evolution, then why do you talk about it so much? Now, I'm not worried about death thanks to the grace of my telomeres. A peer-reviewed journal said it. I have no reason to doubt it. That settles it. Unless new evidence becomes available. Before we eat, let us all bow our heads and thank the farmers who cultivated and harvested this food. Just you wait. When you're on your deathbed, you will finally ask for medicine. You know, I heard Thomas Aquinas recanted right before he died. Hmm. There will be fire and brimstone and earth will be destroyed in several billion years. Why don't you just try not being delusional? Behold, the Christian's nightmare. Now, if you study a well-made banana, you'll find it's a consequence of evolution. Artificial selection in this case. I will spare all of you my screams of, oh, Darwin. The point is, we'd all sound like jerks. Arrogant, condescending, and that's what a lot of Christianese sounds like, too. And credit where it's due, by the way. I didn't write these. Most of these came from readers of my website who suggested them when I asked for ideas years ago. You can check the link below for the full article. Now, I want you to share this video with 100 people. I mean, God won't love you and nothing will happen. It, it'd just be really, really nice of you. My name is Hemant Mehta, and I write at FriendlyAtheist.com. What do you want to see a video about? Let us know in the comments below, and we'll be sure to check it out. And don't forget to subscribe.